Sekidon Tandagidigba, on top the 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. curfew for Edo, as Niger Army 1 begin Ogbonge seven day operation, we go end the Kilikili Tifitifi way the shell for the state. Edo State's Governor Godwin Obaseki don't tell security agencies for the state. So make them put body well on top the 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. coffee where government be put for ground to take reduce the Yamayama plus Katakata where bad people be the cause for the state after them hijack and SARS protest. Governor Basaki talked this one as in they received the general officer on top commanding two divisions for Niger Army, Major General Anthony Omozoje for government house Benin City. As in Karawaka entered the state, to so come tell the way can see governor, same military one begin Ogbonge seven day security operation. We then go use take bab the bad people where they cause bege for the state. I want to thank you for Governor Basaki come salute the chief of army staff plus other senior security officers. On to say them ensure say the September 19 election we shall for those state. They free and fair. In your answer, coffee will be there for the state, but some people no grief follow him. But now, in don't and the on top of him, and the state go there under serious lockdown from 10 o'clock for night, go reach 6 o'clock for morning. The way can see Governor Yan say this one way they want to do so now to take support military seven day security operation and then go make sure say them deal with anybody where they grab for coffee time. Well, uh, first, we have a subsisting coffee in a door which has been, it's been breached and to support and align with this seven-day heightened security efforts, we are reinforcing the curfew from 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. daily. Please, the town should be on lockdown, and anybody found outside within this period should be dealt with according to law. We will be increasing consultations with our various stakeholders, traditional rulers, youth groups, religious leaders, over these next seven days uh, to sensitize them and also to solicit for their support, cooperation, and information. Uh, we have the data on those inmates that escaped from our correctional facilities and commencing immediately, we will be flashing their names and photographs and the names of their next of kin on social media and all television stations in the state. We will be, we, we want to make sure that we let citizens have the numbers, the hotline numbers they can call to provide very useful information to the security services to go after uh, these uh, persons, these criminals, and any other uh, criminals, particularly people you know have arms which they are keeping uh, in their premises. Governor Basaki comes to you and say, those states being hot well for the end SARS protest time. Sick of say bad people come begin cause Katakata, Yamayama plus Yaga Yaga to take show as body they do them on top of the September 19 governorship election which shall for the state. The way can see Governor come salute the commanding officer for the correct security operation when they want to do for the state. He comes to assure them, say governments go give them up and get support, make everything fit go back to normal for Edo before Keres Masko Waka come. I want to thank you for your very kind words and your congratulatory message to me. I have no doubt that you and your men contributed largely to the successful conduct of a very peaceful and what has been adjudged to be a very fair electionary process in Edo State. And I want to express my profound gratitude and appreciation to the Chief of Army Staff through you and to other very senior military officers. I also want to thank you um, for the support that you have continued to give the brigade commander through the very difficult uh, couple of weeks that uh, we have gone through as a result of hoodlum hijacking the otherwise peaceful protests by the NSAS protesters. You know, a door was a hot belt. Um, and you realize that the spillover of the elections had effects on the activities of the hoodlums in uh, Edo State. You can see clearly from the patterns of the, their actions in Edo, they went after uh, their friends in the correctional facilities and breached 
the two correctional facilities in it, the state, just to get make sure that they got their colleagues out of those centers. And so we're very, very glad and happy that you are here to support uh, the security forces on ground in their planning, in articulating a strategy to restore normalcy and peace to a do ahead of the uh, Yuletide holidays. I want to assure you that the state government will support you 100% fully in this, um, uh, in this uh, effort. We trust the professionalism of the security uh, uh, men. We know that you, uh, you are professional and you will respect the human rights of citizens. Um, citizens will not be violated. Uh, their rights will be respected. Uh, but, however, um, indiscipline and criminality will not be condoned. Major Omozo Jekonya and saying Kariwaka inside those states to collaborate with other security agencies. Make all of them for fit chuk I put on top of the Kenya Mayama way enters protest being caused for the state. And now they go begin come out and make everybody for fit they all right. In Yan said them go make sure say them bad plenty bad people, plus still collect all their bad weapons for the seven day security operation. The commanding officer still come talk saying that this same operation then do for Oshun, Kwara, or your and the Kitty states will produce so Obonga results. And now when they don't carry Waka enter Edo state, bad people don't enter Big Wahala. So come say them go fix serious checkpoints for some Obonga places for inside Benin City. And if the soldiers where they ground no reach for the operation, they go come call other military men where they get for Ibadu and Akure to come join them. The Army, the Air Force, Civil Defense, DSS, the NDLA, Correctional Services, Road Safety, we are all present. What we want to do has already been done in some other states within 2 DVR and uh, it's yielding very positive results for us. If we don't actively go after these criminals, you give them the room and liberty to plan, choose their targets at will, carry out this criminality, and just walk away. If we don't interrupt that circle, others will be emboldened, and we have very serious situation on our hands. So. The seven days heightened security operations will involve us establishing fixed checkpoints at very critical locations within the city. And then we have roving teams that will establish snap checkpoints so they can be at a place one hour they relocate. And most of the activities will be intelligence driven. That is why we have brought everybody on board. On my part, we will be supporting the effort with a canine unit from Lagos that will be here with them for 10 days with the dogs who help us in the search for weapons and other dangerous items. Then we we'll also have cordon and search targeted at those hot spots that the intelligence arm will highlight. We will go deliberately after them. Uh, those places uh, in search of these uh, criminals and the weapons that they, they have with them. Additionally, we have men on standby in Ibadan and Akure to reinforce the effort if need be. Uh, after the seven days, we'll do an evaluation to see the effects and uh, if there is a need, we can extend uh, just to make sure that uh, we get the situation within the states to very manageable, possible barriers minimum as we enter the uh, Utah uh, season. So this one are the Ogwon game for me to carry on given now uh, on top inside Edo today. Uh, as Abbas Eki don't turn that on top the 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. curfew for Edo, as Niger Army 1 begin Ogwon game seven day operation, we go end the Kilikili Tifi -kili -tif way the Shelly for the state. Make us a bit at TMC TV. Now you carry this up one game for me. They can't give you now. My name now is Aborio Boom from Benin.